and and at separate times I've made a hundred dollar donation here or there just to like stay stay on the books and stay in the good graces and go to the events to meet the hot chicks. Well, you also must feel that they do good work. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not only interested in women. Um, Although that's not yeah. a terrible reason to do it, is it? No, 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 no. But I'm not. I'm not totally one dimensional. <laughs> um, but they 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 have dinners and they have. Um, it's it's quite something. It's it's a very effective fundraising scheme. So they get you all in a room, and then you all have to say you each have to say how much you're going to give. And so it's very competitive. And and it's also uh, very cult like, isn't it? I'm sorry. It's very cult like, isn't it? Uh, it's, it's very effective. Yeah, I guess it's I guess it could be cult like. And so to to really be involved in the federation, you have to give thousands of dollars a year. Um, so I've never been that involved. Uh, does but, the Jewish uh, Federation? I dated someone who was who was heavily involved, and she talked. She was in the like the leadership circle for for my age bracket, the twenty to forty year old age bracket. And she was in that, and so she was at a dot com uh, startup in two thousand, and I think she pledged something like five thousand dollars, and other people in in the room with her were pledging tens of thousands of dollars. But you had to pledge something like a minimum of five thousand dollars to to be in the leadership. Circle. Circle. Does the Jewish Federation publish the Jewish Journal? Uh, they used to subsidize it, uh -huh. but uh, they went their separate ways about three years ago. So the, the Jewish Journal is a non-profit, and it is not subsidized by the Jewish Federation any longer. Uh -huh. uh, but most Jewish newspapers in the United States are subsidized by Jewish federations. Luke, it's always good to talk to you. I'm, I'm fascinated by uh, how your mind works, and I appreciate you coming on. And uh, if you learn any new revelations about this story, I, I hope you'll uh, blog about them and, and tell us about it. Thanks, Mark. I enjoyed it. Luke Ford from LukeFord.net. We'll continue. This is TalkRadio1.com. I am Mark Germain, broadcasting live every weeknight from 8 p.m. to 10 p.m.